This video demonstrates serial output on the ATtiny85 using the Arduino IDE. If you are watching this video from YouTube, please be sure to check out the project on Hackster at www.hackster.io slash pori. I just finished programming my chip, so I need to change the options in the menu. I've just unplugged the programmer, and now I'm connecting my USB cable. First, I will ensure the COM port of my FTDI cable is selected. Next, I select the correct programmer. Finally, I will open the serial monitor from the menu. As I do this, I am holding down the reset button on my circuit, so we can see the output start from the setup routine. Here you can see the serial output being displayed in the serial monitor window. Of course, this will continue as long as the window is open. Let me jump ahead in time here a little. I will press the reset button now, so we can see the program restart from the beginning. You can write anything you want to the serial output window in your own programs. Just remember that the memory on the AVR Tiny Chips is limited. Using the serial output in your program can consume a lot of memory. If you are using the serial output for debugging, you will want to disable the statements in your code when you are done debugging. You can do this using conditional compile statements. If you are using the serial interface to communicate with other devices, just be sure to be creative with the strings that you use. Thanks for watching the video, and good luck in your programming.